Well, the weather is certainly uh, in the spirit, and this morning we're getting in the spirit of the holidays with some make home holiday decorations. <laughs> Ann Reynolds is our, of course, our resident Pinterest <laughs> expert. Oh, does that a, that's an official title? Okay, I think, I'll isn't take it. it. <laughs> um, so this time we've got use for wine bottles because some people probably uh, have some empties from the from the Thanksgiving holiday, and yeah. now uh, there's a good crafty way to use those to help decorate for uh, the upcoming holidays. Yeah, right? don't throw your wine bottles away after a party because you can actually make holiday decor. And I'm gonna start over here this one has three bottles and that's uh, what I loved about it it's perfect for some type of a mantle yeah. centerpiece or your buffet this says joy of course and easy easy to make just gonna need some spray paint what I'm gonna recommend is you highly that you start out with the spray paint that has a primer in it primer. a okay. primer in it definitely and in this cold weather you're gonna have to do several different coats and let yeah. it dry and keep doing it till you get a nice enamel maybe but wear a glass a gas mask with it too <laughs> <laughs> it takes a little while to dry but once you get a nice coating next thing you're gonna do what I loved is a lot of the ones that looked so professional and so well done yeah. finished are the ones with twine and you're just going to take I the like twine that. give it a little knot on the top of your thing and then you're just going to roll it around now my tip to you is going to be don't get out the Elmer's glue for this. This is where you want to use your Gorilla Glue. Gorilla, you okay. really want one that's going to dry in about 10 seconds so that you can make sure that everything right. stays. You don't come back and it's all unraveled. Right, right, it's right. done and you can move on to the next bottle. Another thing that you can do, you, you know, sky's the limit with these. You can actually you know, spend a lot of money on the toppers and yeah. getting letters. I just drew on the letters with paint and that's the paint that you're going to use of these little craft oh, okay. paints. It's so simple to do. Remember, this is just something you want to be customized and right. you want it to have some charm to it. So you can paint the letters on and of course toppers, whatever you want to do whatever's going to work for your house and your decor so that's one way you can do it for a centerpiece that's beautiful but i think this might be this my is favorite. your favorite yeah. okay i love these as well you can actually buy these in boutiques and things like that and they charge yeah. you a lot of money so you can yeah. make them at home you're going to use your red enamel paint and what you're going to do for the santa is you're just going to take some black felt and you can maybe buy a belt buckle it's very hard to find them yeah. so i actually just use the rhinestones this is where you want to use your elmer's glue because you want to make sure that you can yes. fix them and get them lined up yes. for mrs santa it's just a big chenille um you just have like a chenille wrap and it has wire in it wrap it around again using that twine just give it that very finished look okay and okay. then we're going silver and yeah, white we're again. going silver over here i love this because my theme of my house uh, one of my trees is all snowflakes oh, and silver so okay. i want to try again do what works for yeah. you but this is so simple you're just taking the big bow um, this is just ribbon that you get for Christmas, and you're just going to basically put that around, get an ornament, a nice shiny ornament, mm -hmm. and you can stick that on again, Gorilla Glue, or if it's not working, it's an ornament. So you can actually just hang it on, hang it over. These toppers, there's so many different toppers you can get at craft stores, and you're just going to stick those in and... Voila. Voila. And then it's so simple. And I love the snowman. Is that just not perfect for yeah, the whole winter perfect. season? It really is. It's a little bit All more... of this is perfect. I mean, it's just so fitting. It, it, and uh, once again, I'm impressed with uh, the Pinterest skills. Okay, thank you. Fun resident. to do. You know, when it's this time of year, you want to do something. And yeah. you can use these throughout the holiday season, but also each year, bring them back. Great so. project with the kids when they're on break. That's... All right, we'll have this information on fox45now.com. Thanks again, Ann, for coming in. Appreciate it.